الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أحبت في الله so Islam we know it has pillars it has arkan a pillar how many pillars of Islam are there five mumtaz there are five pillars uh, so Islam has pillars uh, and we say the arkan al khamsa in Arabic they say arkan al khamsa the five pillars and a pillar, do you know what a pillar does? Pillar? A pillar. A, a pillar, it holds up a building. Building? We call them pillars. Like a, this house. Oh. This house, um, th right there, those are pillars outside. Yeah. Those red things, show those pink things right there on the side of the building, those are pillars. Pillars? Yeah. They hold up that, they hold up that wall. They hold up the roof. What do we say in an Amharic? What? A pillar. What do you say? Pillar. Huh. Can I see a pillar? Those, the pink right there that's holding up the building. Those oh, posts. Okay. We call them posts. Hmm. Posts. Back. Okay, we call them posts. Uh, you know what a post? Post like this. These things right here. Those pink things. That's what's... Yeah. Yeah. What do you say in an Amharic? Okay. No. Okay. Okay. That's you said, look, look at this right there. That's a pillar. The no. pillar holds up something. Okay. Okay. I think mm -hmm. Ara. Okay. Ara. Okay. No problem. Fine. So, a pillar, the why we say five pillars in Islam, that means Islam, those five pillars, they support Islam, and you cannot have Islam without those pillars. You have to have those five pillars. Arkan al Islam. The Prophet Sallallahu said, Buni al-Islam ala khams. Buni al-Islam ala khams. You know the hadith? Yeah. Buni al-Islam ala khams. He said that Islam is built on five pillars. The first one, Shahadat in la ilaha illallah wa anna muhammad rasulullah. The first pillar of Islam is the shahada. That you bear witness. That means you believe and you bear witness that there is only one God worthy of worship, Allah. And that Muhammad is his last prophet and messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. That means we don't worship the prophet, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. We worship Allah. Allah, barakallahu And that means you believe that in your heart. And you believe that and practice that on your limbs, on your, with your, by making salat and doing all your ibadah. That... Uh, is a part of your iman. That's a part of your faith. So, the first pillar is that we bear witness that there is no God worthy of worship. Only Allah is the only one who should be worshipped. And that Muhammad وسلم, is his last prophet and messenger. Yes. That means we don't worship the Prophet وسلم, we don't celebrate his birthday we don't do anything like that, but we follow him. We do the things that he asked us to do. We do the things that he allowed for us to do. And we follow what he did, his sunnah. The Prophet Sallallahu said, Alaykum bi sunnati. It's upon you, my sunnah. That means it's upon us. We have to follow the sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. That's the first pillar of Islam. Okay. Uh, the second pillar, Iqam as salat that means we have to pray five times a day. Yeah. That's all you have to pray. You don't have to pray six times. You don't have to pray with witr at the night. You don't have to pray the night prayer. Those are all extra and they're all excellent and they will bring you closer to Allah. But what you have to pray is five times. Five times a day. The five prayers are Fajr, Dhuhr, Asr, Maghrib, Isha, Mumtaz. Yeah, we said Fajr. No, Mumtaz. Good. Those are the five prayers. Taib. And the third pillar of Islam, Ita az zakat That means we have to pay zakat for the person who has money. If you don't have money, you don't have enough money, and you don't have the wealth, you don't have to pay zakat. But if you get a certain amount of money, 
uh, and some other conditions, you've had that money for one year, then you have to pay zakat on it. Oh. Okay. In but Ramadan? You, oh. No, not in Ramadan. It depends on when you got that wealth. Oh. So a year after, if I get, um, say if I have uh, $2,000 in the bank, and then in one year, after one year, I still have that $2,000, if that is the amount to pay zakat on there, then I will have to pay zakat on it. I'll have to pay 2.5% of that wealth. Okay? 2.5%. Don't worry about that now. But just know that there's a thing called zakat that we have to pay on our wealth, if you have the wealth. The fourth pillar. Pillars hold up something. And these are the pillars of Islam. The fourth pillar is Som Ramadan. Now, and Som Ramadan, that means when Ramadan comes, we fast. Yeah. We fast from... You mean r not Ramadan. Mm -hmm. Ramadan. Yeah, only, only Ramadan is wajib. Right. That's the only time we have to, for sure, fast every Muslim that is able to do so. We fast the month of Ramadan from the time uh, when Fajr comes in, okay, till Maghrib. So during the daylight hours, we fast, no eating, no drinking, and we should also be careful about other actions, about, you know, make sure we have good manners, make sure we're not cussing, make sure we're even better in our speech, better than usual. Make sure we're watching good stuff, halal, that we're not uh, doing muharramat, especially during those times. Right. And then the fifth pillar is Hajj al-Bayt al-Haram liman istata'a ilayhi sabil. That means the, the fifth pillar is that we make the pilgrimage to Mecca. If you are able to do so, that means if you have the money, if you have the means, uh, if a woman, if she has a, uh, a guardian, someone to take her, and all of those other prerequisites for making the Hajj. And if you're able to do so, meaning you're not too sick, you're not too old, and it's difficult. So those are the... Pillars of Islam, and we ask all the Almighty to accept our good and will forgive our evil. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and Muhammad.